Hello, welcome to AI Medical School. In this video, we are going to talk about drugs for nausea and vomiting. But before we start, if you haven't subscribed to a channel, so please subscribe to it and like the video. Let's start. Antiemetics should be prescribed only when the cause of vomiting is known, for example, drugs particularly cytotoxic chemotherapy, post-operative, motion sickness, pregnancy, and migraine, because otherwise, they may delay diagnosis. If antiemetic drug treatment is indicated, the drug is chosen according to the etiology of vomiting. Dexamethasone has antiemetic effects and is used in vomiting associated with cancer chemotherapy. It has additive effects when given with high-dose metoclopramide or with a 5-hydroxytryptamine receptor antagonist such as ondansetron. The mechanism of action of dexamethasone as an antiemetic is unknown, but may involve the reduction of prostaglandin synthesis. Antihistamines Indications Motion sickness, drug-induced vomiting, vestibular disorders, such as vertigo and tinnitus. Mechanism of action. Competitive antagonist at the histamine H1 receptor. Preparations and dose. Cyclizine. Valoid tablets. 50 mg. Injection 50 mg or ml. Oral 50 mg up to 3 times daily. IM or IV injection 50 mg 3 times daily. Promethazine. Phenagon tablets. 10 mg, 25 mg, elixir. 5 mg or ml. Injection. 25 mg or ml. Oral for motion sickness prevention. 20 to 25 mg. At bedtime the night before travel. IM or IV 25 50 mg. Side effects. Drowsiness. Anti-muscarinic effects, urinary retention, dry mouth, blurred vision, palpitations, arrhythmias and rashes. Cautions or contraindications. Caution in prostatic hypertrophy, urinary retention, glaucoma and pylorodiodinal obstruction, due to anti-muscarinic effects. Drug interactions, see National Formulary. Phenothiazines. Mechanism of action. Dopamine antagonists act centrally by blocking the chemoreceptor trigger zone in the fourth ventricle. Many drugs produce vomiting by an action on the chemoreceptor trigger zone. Indications Phenothiazines are used for the prophylaxis and treatment of nausea and vomiting associated with diffuse neoplastic disease, radiation sickness and vomiting caused by drugs such as general anesthetics opioids and cytotoxics. Chlorpromazine is associated with more sedation and is usually reserved for nausea and vomiting of a terminal illness. Preparations and dose. Chlorpromazine hydrochloride. Tablets. 25 mg, 50 mg, 100 mg, solution. 25 mg or 5 ml, 100 mg or 5 ml, injection. 25 mg or ml, suppositories, 25 mg and 100 mg, oral 10 to 25 mg every 4 to 6 hours, IM 25 mg then 25 to 50 mg every 3 to 4 hours, birectum in suppositories, 100 mg every 6 to 8 hours. Procloperazine tablets 5 mg, stematal tablets and suppositories, 5 mg, syrup, 5 mg or ml, injection, 12.5 mg or ml, oral 20 mg initially, then 10 mg after 2 hours, prevention, 5 or 10 mg 2 to 3 times daily, IM 12.5 mg followed if necessary after 6 hours by an oral dose. Demperidin and metoclopramide. Mechanism of action. Block dopamine receptors and inhibit dopaminergic stimulation of the chemoreceptor trigger zone. Indications. 
Dimperidin is used particularly in post-operative nausea and vomiting, and also gastroesophageal reflux disease and dyspepsia. Metoclopramide is particularly used in nausea and vomiting associated with cytotoxics or radiotherapy. Preparations and dose. Metoclopramide tablets. 10 mg, syrup. 5 mg or ml, injection. 5 mg or ml, oral or IM or IV, over 1 or 2 minutes. 10 mg 3 times daily. Dimperidin tablets. 10 mg, metilium tablets. 10 mg, suspension. 5 mg or ml, suppositories. 30 mg, oral 10 to 20 mg 3 to 4 times daily, maximum 80 mg, by rectum 60 mg twice daily. Side effects. Central nervous system effects are produced by metoclopramide and to a lesser extent by dimperidin due to limited passage across the blood-brain barrier. Extrapyramidal effects include acute dystonias, treated by drug cessation and procyclidine 5 to 10 mg IM or IV, akathisia and a Parkinsonism-like syndrome, drowsiness with high doses of metoclopramide. Galactoria is caused by hyperplactinemia as a result of dopamine receptor blockade. Cautions or contraindications. Contraindicated in gastrointestinal obstruction, 3-4 days after gastrointestinal surgery, where increased motility may be harmful, and pheochromocytoma. 5-hydroxytryptamine receptor antagonists. Mechanism of action. Block the 5-hydroxytryptamine receptors in the chemoreceptor trigger zone and in the gut. Indications. Particularly effective against vomiting induced by highly emetogenic chemotherapeutic agents and radiotherapy used for treating malignancy and postoperative vomiting that is resistant to other agents. Preparations and dose examples. Delacitron, granicitron, ondansetron, palinocitron. Ondansetron tablets. 4 mg, injection. 2 mg or ml. Zofran syrup. 4 mg or 5 ml. Suppositories. 16 mg. Chemotherapy. 8 mg by mouth or 16 mg by rectum 1 to 2 hours before treatment or by IM or IV injection. 8 mg immediately before treatment then by mouth. 8 mg every 12 hours or by rectum. 16 mg daily. With severely emetogenic chemotherapy, treatment is given IM or IV and continued by infusion 1 mg per hour for up to 24 hours. Prevention of post-operative nausea and vomiting. By mouth, 16 mg 1 hour before anesthesia or by IM or IV injection, 4 mg at induction of anesthesia. Side effects. Headache, constipation hypersensitivity reactions. Following IV administration, seizures, chest pain, arrhythmias, hypotension, and bradycardia. Cautions or contraindications. Caution with prolonged QT interval and cardiac conduction disorders.